All right, secondary video here. It's all filmed on the same day, but it'll be uploaded in two different dates. You probably know that because I already did that. But here is Murder Face again. Look at her babies. Look at her babies. And they are happy. What's up, Amanda? Shooting a video with a brand new camera. Kind of. And there is Phyllis. I don't know if you noticed, but it's got like really cool radio stabilization. I did. Yeah. I was. See it? I was Super using cool. it earlier. Yeah, because it is awesome. My videos were shaky before, and now they're not too bad. But anyway, here's the girlies. Hello, girlies. They are doing fine. And Dandy, where's your babies? Are they in the tote? Are they in the tote? Phyllis here might be losing a little bit of condition. Uh, Lucy didn't lose any condition, but she's, you know, she's only got one baby. E Ethel over here, not Ethel, um, Phyllis over here, she, jeez, she has three, three kids, and they are sucking her dry. I mean, as you can tell, this pasture is mowed, 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 and I'm giving them alfalfa too, and some grain. Speaking about grain, hey, can you give them some grain? Give these two girls eight cups and then give those eight cups too. I think that should be enough. And if you want to throw some alfalfa pellets in there, that'd be cool too. Thank you. Anyway, talking to my wife. She don't like being on camera. Oh, the whole point of this video. So I'm trying to get some irrigation going. And there's only one spigot on this whole pro property. And it's almost an acre, so... Yeah, it's, we're on city water. Excuse my mess. But we're on city water. So I got one here. And that's it. It comes off a one inch pipe. So what I did was a real cheap way. Because I just, right now, it's just not the right time to go ahead and get everything done the right way. So for now, I just went out and I got some PVC. Um, and I think this is three quarter PVC. And I just ran about a hundred feet of it all the way out and I attached a 50 foot hose to the PVC and then there's a hundred foot hose to this right here and it keeps going don't mind the hole there it's just irrigating a little more over here and I'm going all the way out here which is about 200 odd feet and I I'm getting some irrigation. It's a real cheap ass way to do it, but it's it's the only way to do it for me right now. Uh, I'm not gonna pay anybody to install an irrigation system because it'll run me uh, a couple grand, I would say. So um, I'm definitely not gonna do that, and I don't have the time right now with this new job to do all of this. I'm gonna pan the camera down a little bit just because I live in an ugly neighborhood and I, uh, you know, I don't really like showing where, I'm at, where exactly I live and anyway, regardless, if anybody really wants to know, you can find out pretty easily. But I got this side of the fencing done too. This is the edge of the property. Um, it goes from there and it goes all the way over here and it goes down and there's the ugly creek. That runs through here. It's dry. It just dried out. But as you can see, uh, the edge of my property is actually a little bit beyond the creek here. And, or actually a little bit on this side of the creek, about, about right there. And then on that side, it's a little bit on the other side of the creek. So it's kind of funny how it works. But I just got to get rid of that trash pile right there. And once I get rid of that, then it'll be all good and ready. Um, I'm going to put some more fencing down there. This is essentially just a run in the middle of both paddocks that I'm going to have on the top and the bottom. Um, 
and this run I'll eventually run chickens and uh, maybe the bucks but these trees have to mature because the buck he loves killing my trees with his horns so this will be the end of one paddock right here on the bottom where the creek area is and then I'm gonna go this way and go all the way until here that'll be another one and then I'll go over there and that'll be another one and I'll have one more on the other side so it's all working out still got to get some trash out of here but it's all working out it'll all eventually be fenced off and these babies will have plenty of room to run around in and I could put them on the bottom versus up here on the top next to the main road where hey what's up bud you want to fight where um, I'm gonna you know you know let's be realistic here they could get stolen up here pretty easily it's a bad neighborhood thank God people don't know what they're worth or else these things would be gone um, it's just that type of neighborhood you know um, I got two dogs now that kind of roam the property so it kind of deters people press them you know I uh, take certain measures to make sure people don't really mess with me on my property and kind of aggressive with the local you know bad people so they know you know kind of leave me alone but anyway you know I, I'm still a pretty nice guy kids go around they want to pet the goats whatever no big deal but the adults is another story you know if you're about 16 and up I don't trust you <laughs> and it's sad to say but that's just how it goes Well, there's all the kids out there. There's all the kids out. We have five on this side, huh? Yes. One, two, three, four. We're missing one. But that over there, that little black beauty over there is going to be the one I'm keeping too. Or we're keeping. Oh, she's beautiful. Just pretty much all black except that white spot on her head. See if I can zoom in on her. Oh, can't zoom in. Well, super steady. Anyway, that's another. I'll have to get a close-up of her. I didn't realize you opened this or else I would have came over here. Oh. <laughs> but I guess that's for another video. Thanks for watching. And goodbye.